Hello everyone, this is Rahul Pawar. In today's video, we are going to talk about one important concept that is going to help you guys in every interview that you are going to attend. That is project based questions or project related questions. You know, I know I have created many videos that are covering project related questions, but every time a subscriber is going for an interview, some of the other new question is coming up, you know, that we are facing trouble to answer. So I wanted to address that problem today and we'll discuss on that. So first thing that we can do is to you know, solve this problem is create a dashboard from the scratch. So when I say create a dashboard from the scratch, do it with a purpose. Like say, take one requirement document, first step. We will try to implement like we do in the real step. So this will give you some confidence. Take one requirement document, okay? And based on that requirement document, create one mapping document, you know, you know, analyze yourself. What is the table that I'm going to consider? What are the columns that I'll have in that? What is the calculation that I'm going to write uh, on that and create one mapping document that way you will get hands on on the mapping document. That will be the second step. Now, third step, start creating your dashboard. Try to improvise every day. Don't do it in a day every day. So you know, do it, you know, you know, take some days to complete it, do step by step. So one day you are trying to understand what is the requirement that you are getting, what is the functionality you need to implement, what is the formulas that you have to write or what is the calculation that you need to derive, do that. Second day, you know, try to create a mapping document on, on that. So when I say create a mapping document, consider yourself you are working in a real time environment and try to create a perfect document. Don't do it, you know, just for the sake of doing. Do it for the sake that you are learning from that so that whenever you get a question in real time on that, you can confidently answer that okay this is what is i have created and if you need any help in that you can just send it to me for review i'll just take check and you know will confirm you on the documents that you have created that is something that we can do and create a dashboard so when i say create a dashboard implement all the functionalities that we do in real time say and uh, use cases of parameter you need to do you know charts you have to do write some calculations try to derive ytd mtd rolling tool do all of this in your uh, dashboards and try to format it as if you know you are going to publish it in the server if not try to create a dashboard in a way that you are going to save that work in tableau public create one such dashboard i'm sure just after making all of these changes you publish it to the tableau public you will only feel confident about yourself okay so make sure you are taking care of all the things formatting dashboard design layouts your fonts your tooltips everything is important and after this is done create one testing document what are the use cases you have tested how you have tested if you are testing it with sample superstore do it if you are connecting to a database and creating a dashboard do testing create one document for that so that way you are creating two documents one is mapping document and another one is testing document you are creating two documents major part of your you know questions in interview this is covered when you are reading a business requirement document if you are getting any questions write it down this will also help you why sometimes in interview he might ask you or oh, no, did you get any questions what kind of questions you have asked then that questions you can tell them that you know i have asked this type of questions to them like that okay so after doing that publish all of your work to tableau public and save it and then while doing this while doing your uh, dashboard preparation also remember to which client you are preparing the dashboard and what is the problem that you are trying to solve or what is how are business going business users going to use your dashboard that is something that we as a tableau developer should know otherwise we'll not be able to justify whatever we are doing how many man hours of work we are going to save with the dashboard that we are building very important are you going to save five hours every day of client that means five into 30 days is 150 hours in a month so calculate that per year that is the number of hours you are going to save for the user and that is what will be you know computed according to rupees or dollars and we will show that you know this is the impact of this dashboard that is how you should think okay so after going to brd brd see what all you are going to optimize 
and see how many man hours you are going to do okay I have come up with some number based on the complexity of the dashboard and you can tell that that is one thing second thing is what is the timeline uh, or the dashboard load time okay every client that you are working for expects their dashboard to be loaded in some particular time like say some clients expect their dashboard to be loaded in 5 seconds 10 seconds 15 seconds based on within that time limit only they have to load it has to load otherwise they will again come back to you and say see dashboard is not loading within a stipulated time it is taking 5 seconds 10 seconds or 15 seconds which is not acceptable so we have to think from that line also and you know optimize or customize our dashboard what are you going to do then try to do one dashboard from the scratch and you know you tell me your feedback after you do i'm sure this is definitely going to help you answer many questions in the interview then you don't have to worry about anyone or anyone else you yourself will be capable enough to answer every question that is coming on project okay so that's it from my side in this video i hope this video has really helped you if it does don't forget to like share and subscribe see you in the next video till then bye bye